Hi, and welcome to ColorLib Video Tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you step by step on how to set up and customize your website homepage widget. To do this, navigate to your WordPress dashboard, then go to Appearance and select Customize. You will be redirected to this page here where you can start customizing the homepage widget. Select Widgets. Newspaper X has two other widget areas which are not displayed here. I therefore advise you to navigate to other pages on your site while using a customizer to view and edit the widgets displayed on these pages. We will start by customizing the home page header area. This is the website section that we see displayed on top here. To make changes, click on the down arrow here to expand. Here, you can add new title, change the story category, and display order. Click on Add New Widget to add a new widget. For example, let's add Audio Widget by clicking on it. Enter the title of the audio. I will name mine Podcast. I will then click Add Audio to either upload the audio or paste a link to the audio. Once done, I will click Add Widget. As you can see, the audio is displayed on the website and you can play and listen. You can reorder the widget sequence by clicking and dragging or clicking the reorder link, then using the top arrow to move up and down arrow to move down. Click on the back arrow and proceed to edit other widgets. Next is the home page content area. This section has five predefined layouts, but you can modify them accordingly to suit your requirements. Add more widgets to this section using the Add Widget button. Post Layout A is the first section after the header. I will click on the down arrow to open it. Here, I can enter the title of the section. Let's name this Popular Stories. We will leave category in order as it is, but you can change it based on your existing stories. Next, I will choose the number of posts to show and post offset by sliding the button here. Finally, I will click on the slider to either enable or disable date and comments from being displayed. Post Layout B is the second section on the site. When you click to expand it, you can edit title, change the story category, order, number of columns, and post to show. Slide the button below to either enable or disable date and comments. Follow the same process to edit and modify proceeding layout C and D as well. Lastly, edit the Newspaper X banner. This is the banner used in displaying ads. Click on Choose Image to upload your banner. Once done, enter the banner URL. This is the link that one is directed to when they click on the banner. As you can see here, there are two banners on the front page. You can add more using the Add Widget button below. You can reorder the widgets by clicking and dragging them to the position of your choice. Click on the back arrow to go back. Home page after content area is the section below the main content. It is made up of four sections. Depending on your preference, you can edit and remove these sections. Click on the down arrow to start making your changes on title, order, and number of columns. Click on Remove to remove a section under this area. Home page sidebar is the sidebar menu that displays to the right of your website. Currently there is nothing. Let's add a widget and choose Archives. I will then enter title as Popular Posts. As you can see, the new title is added. I can then check on Display as dropdown and Show Post Counts. You can add more widgets based on your needs. Click on Back button to go back. Next widget area is the footer. It's made up of four columns. This will be displayed based on the choices you made earlier under the theme options under footer. We have all the four footer widgets displayed. If you want less, go to theme options, footer, and make your choice. 
Click on the footer to edit. On the new window, add a widget based on what you want displayed. The mode of editing and modifying footer widget is similar across the board. Save and publish your changes when done. Now, go back to the dashboard and preview your new site with changes. Congratulations! Your website's front page widgets are now set up and ready to go. This marks the end of our tutorial videos on Newspaper X theme from Colorlib. For support on related questions, it is better to ask on support forum as they have more knowledge than me at colorlib.com forward slash WP forward slash forums forward slash forum forward slash newspaper X. This link is available below in the description area. Last but not least, thank you very much for watching and please subscribe to our YouTube channel to keep you up to date with the latest WordPress theme tutorials.